Vince McMahon was desperately trying to re-sign CM Punk before Money in the Bank 2011. They each brought their own versions of the contract for a public negotiation. Punk pushed Vince by demanding respect, his own jet, his face on everything, a movie, main event at WrestleMania, and everyone's favorite WWE ice cream bars. He demanded Vince to apologize and he did furiously after Punk pushed him too far. John Cena comes out before Vince can sign Punk's version to address them both being babies. Cena don't always see eye to eye with Vince, but he still shows up for work. And Punk is who the fans won, but he's lost sight of reality. Cena punches Punk after Punk goes off on him, for Punk to then decide he's not re-signing. Despite Punk being the heel, this is complete reality, with the poster boy, the out of touch man who only cares about himself. How could Punk not become white hot being the voice of the voiceless?